One of the key tasks of an employer is to identify risks in the work environment and prevent them from causing harm. Workplace bullying, harassment and violence is a serious risk that can have a negative impact on the well-being of workers. Therefore, it is very important to be aware of unhealthy communications in the work environment and intervene early with actions to prevent health risks. The actions should be part of the health and safety plan of the workplace. One of the things that the employer can do is to write a communication agreement in cooperation with employees. The agreement helps to set standards and provides guidelines for healthy communications. Another thing is to create a platform for employees to discuss their concerns about the work environment or to complain about expected bullying, harassment and violence. The platform can also be used to provide information and support to employees. When workplaces prioritize the health and safety of their workers, they are sending a clear message that bullying, harassment and violence is not tolerated in the working environment. When issues related to bullying, harassment and violence arise in the work environment, it is important to react in accordance with the health and safety plan. The plan supports managers in ensuring a good procedure and gives the parties an overview of the process. The plan should be accessible to all workers. At the start of a case of bullying, harassment and violence, it is important that the parties get the opportunity to express their views individually. The employer must pay attention to the provision of information and prepare the victim to step forward with information about the case. When the case has been resolved within the workplace, the employer must take action to prevent the situation that was complained about from happening again. It is important to respond quickly to bullying, harassment and violence but it is equally important to focus on preventing the problem before it arises. Open communications, quick responses and everyone's cooperation are always the best way to ensure healthy communications. Let's work together and create a desirable work environment that does not accommodate bullying, harassment and violence.